take off the top. It's really, really important. <clears throat> and even if it means to go and take a towel, you see, I have this kind of sarong around, uh, around my arm. So it helps me to, 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 to be free in my movement. It's really important. Okay, so are you ready? You ready? Good, great. So sit straight, sit straight. <clears throat> Close your eyes and take deep breath in, into your nose and breathe out through your mouth. <sighs> but allow yourself for the loud out breath because with the sound, you release lots of tension. Again, in, <sighs> out, and again, in, <sighs> out, and again, in, out. Great. And because it's early morning and Stella asked to do face workout class because I have different classes, we will go for the class which is invigorated class, which gives you more energy. So breathe in again. Lift your shoulders as close to your ears as possible. And on the out breath, ha, really do it loudly. I cannot see you. We are all mute. So you can really be loud. And again, in, Ha, perfect. Let it go. Let it go. Again, in. Ha. Yes, all that tension, worries, concerns, let it all go. Again, in. Ha. Great. Now, rotate your right shoulder a little bit, backwards and forward, just a little bit to allow yourself for, for the energy to flow. And left one, backwards and forward. And backwards and forward. Great, and both, forward. Yes, feel that opening in your chest. Start to breathe deeply. Release yourself from all worries and forward. In the, in the range which is safe for you. Don't force anything, don't force anything. It should be fun. We just go through few techniques today, which I hope will give you the, the sense what my classes are about. Okay, perfect, very good. And now the face which is slim, the face which is not puffy, this is the face when lymphatic drainage uh, uh, flow freely. On my Sunday class, I spend lots of time on the lymphatic drainage, but today we will just do one technique which will help to drain the lymph from the head all the way down. Above the collarbone, we have two amazing lymph glands, amazing lymph, lymph nodes, which, which collect all that lymph, and then body knows what to do with that. So how we do that? We cross our hands, we use fingers, we put them behind our ears and very gently, like you would stroke the cat, you just slide along both sides of your neck towards that lymph node and you leave it. So you don't cross, you just direct the fluid down. Exactly. And you see, if you do it very gently, you can experience that power of touch. We sometimes need that hug, that cuddle, and often there is nobody around, but we can give it to ourselves. We can do that. It's like you would stroke the cat and you are this cat and you can give yourself that nice, warm, gentle touch. More time you repeat that, it's better lymph likes the repetition and stimulation. And a few more times you can close your eyes and you will feel how reassuring, relaxing, warm and nice it is to do. So when you feel stress, when you feel really nervous or when you feel really lonely, just do that, do that to yourself. It's very nurturing. Great, perfect, fantastic.
Good. And now we will apply the oil or cream. Uh, don't apply too much of oil because then you will have no grip on the muscle. But if it's not enough, it will stretch the skin unnecessary. So the, the middle is really important in that. Start always from the chest and go up because we want to lift. We don't want to pull any muscles down. Do it slowly. I know that many of you are trained by life to be strong and resilient and fast and deliver and etc. That class is the chance for you to approach yourself a little bit differently with more tenderness, with more delicate way. Then cheeks. Oh, I have too much oil. I don't need so much oil. And then forehead as well. Forehead as well. Great. Perfect. Yes, I still have too much oil on my, on my chest. Great. So we start from the technique which I name face salutation. Those who, of you who do yoga, you know how amazing, profound and complete sun salutation is. It really works on the whole body. The same is with face salutation. They are three phases of the movement which stimulate the whole face. And this you can do when you apply your cream in the morning or evening, you can always do that technique. So we place hand on the chest, we press in, we cross, and then we lengthen the neck and we flip under the jaw. And again, exactly, John, I knew that it will end that way, that you will take this t-shirt off. There is no other way to do this massage. Crossing, lengthening and flipping. So what do we do here? We release the tension from the chest, we lengthen the neck and we lift the jaw. So don't go to the cheek, that stay on the jaw. And again, cross, lengthen and lift. And again, chest store lots of tension. It's very emotional part of our body. So we want to release that. And as you see, I am not sitting straight. I'm almost moving because it's a very calming and soothing motion in the body. It's like a waves of the ocean. Great. Soft hand. Remember, there is no outcome there. Only outcome is here that you just enjoy that. That's it. And again. Cross, lengthen the neck, bring that leg out and flip the jaw. You should start to feel the warmth on your chest. It's a good sign. It's a sign that you, you allow the system to receive more oxygen. Great. Now we go to the jaw. Rest the jaw on the edges of the palm, like, you know, from, from 30s, these uh, pictures of the ladies in a swim cup looking beautiful. This is what we want. But really edges of the palm on the jaw, no cheeks. Breathe in, head down, and on the out breath, slide up to the temples. Exactly. And again. And you see how important it is that your hands are light. And again. Please keep head down because we don't want any pressure on the back of your neck. And up. And up. It's just lifting the jaw. Don't go on the cheeks. Just be on the edge. Lifting the jaw. Super. And again. And up. And up. And up and up and let's connect these two movements chest and jaw chest neck and jaw and again chest neck and breathe breathe use your breath breath is the cheapest medicine you can imagine <sighs> breathe all the tension 
Just let it go. Release that face from any tension. Good. Jaw up and up and up and up. Fantastic. Well done. Now we go to the cheeks. What we want, we want this apple cheeks. Sometimes people ask me how, how I got them. <laughs> and I'm saying I got them by doing twice a week my classes, which is really true. If you do your massage regularly, twice a week, no more often, no, no often than that because it's a deep work. You really shape, you change the shape of your face. So we go to the cheeks. We use the edges of our um, index fingers and we slide down and now once we reach the cheeks we want to lift them it's almost like you would like to lift them and you take them with you up to the temples and again don't apply too much pressure some of you may feel discomfort when you are somewhere here some of you may feel pain it means that you are very stressed because they are energy lines, they are energy channels, and it, it means that you really, really stress. Again, and up, and again, and up. It's like bringing these cheeks out. Great, perfect. And you could really feel the warmth. They are very happy. <laughs> they want to be seen. So, <laughs> perfect. Very good. One more time. And again, let's connect chest, neck, and the jaw. Chest, neck, and jaw. And again, chest. It's, it's, like, it's like really like dancing with the waves. Why it's important that you also allow yourself to move because it takes you from that rigid stage of tension and uncertainty which we all feel now jaw up and up and up and up and the cheeks up let it breathe let it breathe good and now we go to the forehead what we want for the forehead we want to lift the forehead and open it's usually very tight because of the pressure which comes from the scalp so how we do that we use edges of our index fingers and again we slide through the middle line and then we open like a book exactly and again you breathe in really breathe out in it's like you would take the the, the splash, like I would splash the face with the cold water on the very hot day. <sighs> Again, open that, yes, yes. Reveal, reveal your beautiful face. Fantastic, one more time. <sighs> Great, very good. Now we go through all phases together. We will do it a little bit faster because it's a workout. So breathe in, hand on the chest, and we go. One, two, and flip. One, two, flip. One, two, flip. One, two, flip. Jaw up, up up, up, cheeks, lift them, take them with you up to the temples and the forehead, up and up and up and up. Great. Now we will take care of the muscles of the jaw. This muscle, if they are tight, they literally pull the face down. And then we have that sagginess, that feeling of heaviness on the face. So we want to stimulate them, give them tone again. And we be quite bold with them. We will use our knuckles, knuckles. So we will place the soft part of your knuckles just at the back of your jaw where this big muscle is, how you recognize that muscle. If you place your hands and you move your jaw left, 
and right. Can you feel that? It moves under your fingers. This is that muscle. The name is masseter muscle, and it really, really needs to be released. So we place the soft knuckles. I'm using my thumb under the jaw resting. It helps me to relax my hands and you start to knuckle that back of your jaw. Always out, not in, out, because we want to open the face. Be soft, please don't be punishing towards your face. You want to support your face, great. Some of you do it really, really intentionally. Close your eyes and allow all this tension. You are surprised probably how much tension you hold there. Just let it go and feel that warmth spreading from the muscles. Fantastic. Now you go a little bit closer to the jaw, but stay on the jaw. Don't go on the cheeks. Just here, head down. No pressure on the back of your head. No pressure in the shoulders and even closer to the chin. Chin store lots of emotion, especially unspoken ones. All those which we don't want to share or we don't know how it's there. And again, go backwards and give that good stretch and release, you see? It's, it's that way, perfect, fantastic. And again, closer and out, good. You should really start to feel the difference. Now we will use our fingers. Left hand is resting on the left side of the face. Right hand, spread your fingers, use your thumb so you almost hold the jaw between your thumb and your fingers and your fingers start to circulate from the chin all the way out to the ear. And again, you really giving, it's like you would hold the jaw, don't be afraid. It's a strong bone there. We often are suppressed in the way how we express ourselves because we were told to be strong. Uh, we were sometimes told do not express any feelings, do not show them. This will be all stored in our jaw. And then it will impact our neck and our shoulders as well. Great, opposite. Yes, good, very nice. Very nice. Again, keep this kind of rhythm in that and feel how nice it is to do that, to give your face that release <sighs> and breathe out. Use your out breath. Free yourself, free yourself from any tension. Good, perfect. Now we will use index finger and middle finger. We will sandwich the jaw and slide all the way up, all the way up. We want to shape that jaw, that line. We want face to look and feel lifted and supply with oxygen opposite, up to the ears. Great, very good, very good, great. Perfect. And again, chest, neck, jaw, chest, neck, jaw. You feel now much uh, relaxed. You know how to do that. So start to enjoy that. Good. Jaw, up, 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 and up, and cheeks to the temples to the temples and the forehead, open forehead, open it, open and open. Let's go now to the cheeks and first let's work under the cheeks. We will use our fingers again, use your thumb resting underneath, but 
fingers will just circulate under, but intention is to lift that cheeks, let them breathe, expose them. And if you feel tension or even pain, do it gentler, but don't stop to do that because it means you really need that stimulation. It means there is blockage in energy flow. And again, go up to the ears and again, underneath, underneath, underneath. Good, one more time, underneath, lift, lift. You should really feel good burn now on your face. Can you feel the warmth on your face? Fantastic, great. And now on the cheekbones, but be gentler because skin is thin here. So here more gently, so you can practice how gentle you can be towards yourself. Just gently, gently. You, we don't want to stretch the skin unnecessary. Go to, to the temples, to the temples. And again, on the cheeks, gently. It's like you would talk to your face. Come on, just relax, just relax. Give it all up. Show me your beauty. <laughs> Great. And now stay on that temples. Flat fingers on the temples and slowly make the circles up, out, down. If you can, you can rest your elbows on the table if you're very close. If not, just keep your elbows down on your chest and very slowly close your eyes and allow yourself to release any stress, any concerns. Just let it go. Don't hold on to that. It's a past already. Just let it go. Let it go resentments, grudges, reproaches, just don't allow this to stop you to live your life. Let it go. Great. Good. And open your eyes. And again, fingers on the top of your cheeks. One more time. Great. Now we go to the lips. Lips are really important. We talk all the time. So they working, working, working. Um, many of you are concerned about the lines above the upper, upper lips. So I show you techniques which works like the collagen <laughs> without putting any collagen. <laughs> it's very nice technique and it really brings lots of blood around the lips. So they feel alive, they feel full. How you do that? First, we will do preparation to that. And we will circulate using soft finger pads of both your hands gently. Again, my thumbs are resting underneath. Just warming up. We often tight our lips. We do this kind of uh, face, especially when we are not listened when we are not hurt, it's, it's frustration, it comes there. But today you are listening your face and you are, and you're giving your face what the face needs the most, your time, your attention, your care. And now use just the right hand, left can just rest and use your middle finger and start to wrap just wrap above the lip line. It's not desperate and aggressive way of trying to remove any lines from your face. It's just to bring the oxygen to them so they can be integrated into your skin and the opposite. Left hand may be not so fast, doesn't matter. It will still work. And now both. Great. And now also straight out just to the corner, not down, to the corner. 
Ha, and again, and again. Rap, 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 rap. Great, and stretch out. Perfect. And again, our second movement from this face salutation, lift all that, lift all that. Great. We have also that lines here, and this is a very important line. Stella mentioned about it. This is the sign of our laughter in life. This is the most important uh, lines we can have, and we should be so proud of them because it means we were able to distance ourselves many times in our lives and just laugh when everything looked like we should cry, but we laugh and this is that lines, but we don't want them to be, to be sharp. We don't want to look rough. We want them to be soft and nicely integrated in the skin. How we do that? Left hand on the right cheek, which will prevent stretch of the skin. Um, right middle finger, slowly, very slowly, just cross that lines and wrap them, wrap them. It's like celebrating them, but giving them, giving them that attention. And now you can speed it up a little bit, but your finger has to be very gentle. If you do anything faster on the face, you need to release the pressure. Very gently, really, really exercise how gentle you can be. And just, bring as much oxygen between these lines, give them, give them that, that fluid that they need. Perfect. And the same on opposite, right hand on the left cheek, left middle finger, touching the lines with love <laughs> and appreciation, gently, 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 and you can wrap a bit faster. Just give them that elasticity. Great. And now middle fingers on the outer part of the eye and just circulate to the middle and press into. And again, gently, gently very gently, great, perfect. And now middle finger of your one hand, my thumb is resting on my cheek, just circulate that line between your eyebrows. This is that line, this is that tension stored there through years or generations. We don't need that. We don't need that. So just give yourself nice circulation here. Release that, release that. All these unspoken emotions, it's better to say them than to express them on your forehead. Good. And now use two fingers and what you did here and here you will also do here. It's just alternate rubbing, but very softly, very softly, that rub alternate in an alternate way. Great, perfect. And now go a bit higher. Again, my thumbs are resting on the chin, on the cheeks, and just short movements, up and down, short movements, and through the whole forehead. Face massage, if it's done well, it's a great exploration for the skin. So you should feel afterwards the change in the texture and opposite side. Good. And speed up a little bit, a little bit. Give it good warmth. Perfect. And now use one hand and lift and open through the middle and open, yes. Allow yourself to, to go taller with that movement. Great, like a beautiful statue. 
Fantastic. Great. Perfect. And let's go back to the to the chest again and crossing and lengthening and flipping. Cross, lengthen. <sighs> and breathe and feel that freedom, that playfulness in you, that joy of the moment, liberation from everyday struggles and problems. I have comments from people who join my classes regularly that it really helps them in this lockdown to connect, to relax. So it's not only visual change, it goes much, much deeper than that. Cheeks, <sighs> breathe and joy and forehead and forehead and again and again. Great, perfect. How are you feeling? Good? Great. So now let's tap your forearms. Just tapping. An upper arm and give yourself good tap. Well done. Well done. You did it. You could be in a million places this morning, but you decided to be here and now and you did something great for yourself. Opposite hand. It's very good for stimulation. If you feel during the day lack of energy, just do that. It will really help. And again, and a little bit on your chest gently with proud, <laughs> with pride. Exactly, exactly. And done. Well done. Well done. Great job. Great job. 